everyone! Welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm going to class. Follow me to the stairway of success. <laughs> I was about to say heaven, but I guess it is a sunny day, so that works too. Check out this glass door. Is it just me, or does it look so beautiful? So inspiring to get up to school every day and see that. Alright, so that's the map. And we are headed to the class called Lab and Developing New Products and Services. I will also take the elevator because <laughs> I have not located the stairs yet for this particular section of the building. And also, isn't this logo so pretty? I think we all need this type of attention and detail in our interior design once we afford a studio apartment. Now, this class I'm taking is for product management. Um, future careers and I get to work with uh, in groups of seven and we each get like different companies so you could possibly be working with like Meta, Google, Amazon, um, a gaming company etc and work directly with the client to come up with new features and products. Oh before we head in this is the view it reminds me of hiking a little bit you know when you get to the top of the mountain and now we're officially in class lunch break my favorite part of the day so hungry there's like salads and chips do i want to be healthy unhealthy sushi okay i ended up with sushi <laughs> am i the only one who watched barbie growing up because i remember her saying in barbie diaries <laughs> she's like you have to get your head out of those books and live a little well here's what i'm doing so <laughs> we're gonna pick up some oops not this door um we're gonna pick up some plants for health and wellness and it's gonna be a succulent that I grow indoors and get to keep and watch it grow and flourish isn't that like the best start of spring I wonder what options they have we also get a light bulb because um, seasonal affective disorder um, it's like which means you feel happier if you're around the sun, under sunlight, and even have artificial indoor lighting. And I totally feel that. Sometimes mental health gets the best of us, and we need that break to breathe and relax. So, this is why I'm here, and I'm so glad the school prioritizes this and understands how stressful it is to be a student sometimes, and how stressful it is to be a person in general. Now that we have our plant, of course I chose the pink one. You know me already, it's my favorite color. Now I'm gonna head to the library to get some work done. And if you haven't seen any of my other videos, you do know I love taking the scenic route to class. Trust me, the view is worth it. I love art and architecture, so I admire these buildings every day. I've taken some art history courses here as well. Um, it was like Roman civilization, and art of the East China, as well as Roman art and archaeology. So definitely recommend those if you come. And I've also taken some like actual drawing and painting classes. It really helps you look at the world from a different angle and appreciate everything that's around you. And appreciate the people too. So I'm heading into the library. This is where I used to take my humanities and history classes as an undergrad. And I also worked in this building as well. Could you believe it? <laughs> I was doing like design and um, like orientation, graduation stuff here. Time to get some work done. So this quarter I've been taking four classes total, which is what most full-time people do. So aside from this lab class that I'm taking, I'm also doing negotiations and consumer behavior to learn more about how to be an effective like haggler slash a business deal making person. And there's like so many strategies that you should keep in mind, like having a reservation price, like a price you wouldn't go any lower, any higher, depending on if you're 
the buyer or the seller your best alternative option um, and just knowing what the other party's interests are and yours so you can figure out what you're willing to compromise on and then consumer behavior because of course you have to know your customer in order to um, serve them well which applies to both business and life I would say and this class is a lot about how people make purchasing decisions, what goes in their mind when they think about a consideration set and when they finally make a purchase at the checkout. It also addresses different cognitive biases to keep in mind, um, long-term memory and how people retrieve certain aspects when they're thinking of purchasing something or not and how effective you can be with certain marketing strategies so you can make sure that you're informing people of your product in the right way that they remember and can recall easily when the time comes. And there's like a ton of other stuff that we learn in class. So these are pretty popular and I totally recommend you take them. So to unwind, I usually order delivery <laughs> and I love sushi. So I just realized I had sushi for lunch and now again for dinner. <laughs> Yay, new day! I'm so excited to see these cherry blossoms. And um, according to the map, it's near like a three minute walk from the Museum of Science and Industry. And it's called the Jackson Park Cherry Blossoms. And it's super famous and popular here in Chicago. I think it's ranked like one of the best and most beautiful gardens you should visit, especially during cherry blossom season. So here we are in all its glory. So this area contains about 160 cherry blossom trees that bloom in the spring. So I just wanted to share this with you because I love these trees. They're my favorite and it's pink. Thanks for watching my video and remember to like, comment, and subscribe. I'd love to know where you guys see cherry blossom trees in your own place. <laughs>